So this amendment um, restores funding for the MINDOT Office of Equity and Diversity. Uh, for those of you who do not know what the MINDOT Office of Equity and Diversity does, it plays a critical part in our federal funding uh, in that it manages all of our workforce um, goals, participation uh, on both federally funded and state funded projects where there's a disadvantaged business or a targeted group business goal. It also manages the Davis-Bacon and minimum wage reports and it's a key component of uh, MINDAT operations. The most important thing to note though is uh, this is some pretty easy math coming down so get ready for it. Uh, if we eliminate this office, MnDOT will no longer uh, really be able to uh, bring in federal funding anymore uh, because this office um, participates in a key role of that. And uh, federal funding that we get from MnDOT is approximately $600 million a year. So the easy math is we must have this office and the A19 amendment restores the funding. Members, it's getting a little loud in the chamber. Can we please take our conversations outside? Senator Johnson Stewart. Again, that's what the A19 amendment does. I would ask for a green vote. I appreciate that. Thanks.